Hey guys, this is Ek Junwen. Samsung has released a third June update and it brings a lot of improvements in camera and overall performance of the device. The Samsung Camera Manager has addressed several improvements for this update, like performance optimization in different camera scenarios with minimal soldering, optimized portrait mode, optimized system memory when recording at full zoom, optimized autofocus for quick response, and fixes to system apps that causes the overheat. As always, I make sure to wipe the cache from recovery after every update for optimized performance and battery life. After it boots up, I will run App Booster for optimized performance as Samsung suggests to use it after every update. As per Samsung, you will gain 15% of performance, which is awesome. Now we'll make sure that the settings are on max with enhanced processing enabled, 120Hz adaptive, and 1440p display. The initial temperature is at 30 Celsius. Now let's begin. This is the first time I got the highest score compared to any previous updates. The temperature increased by 2 Celsius but the performance didn't throttle at all which is proven with extra score of 17,000. Awesome! Next up, the Geekbench. The initial temperature is at 31 Celsius and after the test, the score and the temperature is similar to first June update. 3D Mark initial temperature was at 30 Celsius and after a minute of testing, I get the exact same score, even FPS, as first June update. Interestingly enough, if you have noticed, the Geekbench score is close to first June update. The camera version has been updated on third June update to 11.0.3.10, while the second June update had the same camera version as first June update. With continuous zooming, we get similar temperature for all three updates. Switching between modes is still better smooth and fast. As per the camera manager, the portrait mode is optimized. However, there is still delay when zooming. I have also recorded the minute of 4K resolution at 60 FPS for those who are interested. I will be testing out the battery life soon, but here are the battery life for the first two June updates, and so far I'm satisfied with it. If you are wondering how I got such high SOT, then check out the video on the top right corner. And yes, this is an Exynos variant. Overall, I'm happy with the third June update. It seems to be the most stable yet. I hope Samsung continues to improve the camera responsiveness. As for the overheat, I haven't experienced it so far even when calling. Anyways, thanks for watching, do like and subscribe, and see you in the next one. Peace out.